Hey guys, Mr. C here. Uh, just wanted to check in and say happy Monday. Uh, definitely hope you make this the best week yet and we are almost at the finish line. But in the meantime, I challenge each and every one of you to take some time, reflect, go for a walk, look out a window, see that the sun is still up and that the world is still turning. Everything will be okay. Hello Panthers, I hope everyone is doing well. I'm thinking right now about our class of 2020. I want to invite all of you that one day you'll be able to come back and visit me. And we can talk about the good old days at Brennan Hall. Um, for all of my students, if you're tired of being stuck in a room and not going anywhere, I would like to suggest you watch some videos that can take you to another time and place. Um, if you want to learn what it was like to be a student in the 1890s, there's a Netflix show called Anne with an E that can put you in the footsteps of a child in the 1890s. If you want to experience the Great Depression and the Dust Bowl, please watch The Grapes of Wrath starring Henry Fonda. If you'd like to um, experience what it was like to fight in D-Day during World War II, Watch the first 27 minutes of Saving Private Ryan. And finally, if you want to experience um, how one man can change the life and save the life of 1,200 people, please watch Schindler's List. Um, it's the story of Oscar Schindler, who saved 1,200 Jews from certain death in concentration camps during World War II. So each of these videos can put you in a different time and place and help you experience what life was like in a different time. Once again, I miss you all, and I wish you good luck. Bye-bye. Well, Brandon Hall, I have a recent poem by an author from Minnesota. When this is over, may we never again take for granted a handshake with a stranger, full shelves at the store, conversations with neighbors, a crowded theater, Friday night out, a taste of communion, a routine checkup, the school rush each morning, coffee with a friend, the stadium roaring, each deep breath, a boring Tuesday, life itself. When this ends, may we find that we have become more like the people we wanted to be. We were called to be, we hope to be. And may we stay that way, better for each other, because of the worst. You know, we're living right now in a time where it's a great tendency to try and place blame and point fingers. But I think we really need to stop and consider the tremendous power of the human spirit and the incredible capacity that people have to care about each other. Stay safe, Brandon Hall, stay well. Hello, Panther Nation. This is Mr. Green here. I know you guys are not used to hearing from me, but I really wanted to reach out to you and let you know that your presence on this campus is missed tremendously. And it's not just because when you're not here, they don't prepare any food in the cafeteria. No, that's not at all. It's because when you are here, this campus has life. You know, the bells are ringing, students and teachers are coming and going. We're together in this incredible learning environment. It's our community and it's like a family-like atmosphere. And when you're not here, it's not like that at all. And so we really, really miss you. Um, I know this is a pretty difficult time in our history. We're probably going to remember this time for a lot of things that we'd rather forget. To send some words of encouragement to you, as we come to the end of this academic school year, let's make up in our minds that no matter what comes our way, no matter how difficult, no matter how unfair, that we are going to do more than simply survive it, that we are going to thrive in spite of it. As we come to the end of this year, it's really important that we dig in and finish this year strong, but let's not take the mindset that we're just going to get through it. Let's change our mindset and say, we're going to thrive in spite of it. You've all shown incredible 
endures to this time. So I think that's an objective that we can all take and that we can all strive and reach together. So again, I want to remind you, we really, really miss having you on campus. So stay safe out there, Panther Nation. May God richly bless and keep you all. Happy Monday morning, Panther Nation. Hope everybody's doing well and ready for a great week of cyber school. I'm proud of all of you guys for persevering through this crazy stretch that we never expected. Special greetings to the class of 2020. And we're thinking about you and want you guys to have as great a last couple months of school as you possibly can. Um, Mondays are always a little crazy in the Marshall family, so I want to share with you a little bit of what life is like in the Marshall family. It's another manic Marshall Monday. Have a great week. Go Panthers!